Start by holding your paddle out of the water with only one hand. Now try playing paper scissors rock with a friend or coach. To make this more challenging, try with both hands and no paddle. Start by rotating from side to side with your paddle out of the water. Keep a good connection with your footrest and seat. Sit upright, slightly in front of vertical and with a long spine. Engage your lower abdominals and bring your centre of mass lower. Keep the shaft of the paddle parallel to your hips. To make this more challenging, perform the same rotational movements with your paddle above your head. Keep your shoulders relaxed with shoulder blades set back and down. Now for an even harder exercise, try the same movement without a paddle. Keep your neck and head relaxed, stationary and in a neutral position. Try to keep your movements slow, controlled and purposeful. Start by holding the paddle above your head and spinning it 360 degrees. Try to limit boat movement and depend on your paddle for stability. Keep a good connection with your footrest and seat. Sit upright, slightly in front of vertical and with a long spine. Engage your lower abdominals and bring your centre of mass lower. Keep your shoulders relaxed with shoulder blades set back and down. Keep your neck and head relaxed, stationary and in a neutral position. Keep your movements slow, controlled and purposeful. Try spinning in both directions and see how many spins you can complete without stopping. For experts, try paddle spinning when wash riding or surfing a downwind runner in your surf ski. Start by sitting stationary in your kayak, then throw and catch a ball from your coach or training partner. Keep a good connection with your footrest and seat. Sit upright, slightly in front of vertical and with a long spine. Engage your lower abdominals and bring your centre of mass lower. Keep your shoulders relaxed with shoulder blades set back and down. Keep your neck and head relaxed, stationary and in a neutral position. Keep your movements controlled and purposeful. Try throwing the ball with both preferred and non-preferred hands. Now try throwing your paddle like a javelin. Be careful not to throw it at anyone. Again, try throwing with both preferred and non-preferred hands. Now you've thrown your paddle, you have to collect it. Try hand paddling with both hands and with alternate hands. Scaling is a great drill to help develop feeling and paddle blade control. This will help move the kayak sideways in a controlled motion. Start by scaling in a figure 8. Keep a good connection with your footrest and seat. Sit upright, slightly in front of vertical and with a long spine. Engage your lower abdominals and bring your centre of mass lower. Keep your movements slow, controlled and purposeful. Move your paddle in a figure 8. Start with your hands on your head and touch your shoulders, knees and toes. Keep a good connection with your footrest and seat. Sit upright, slightly in front of vertical and with a long spine. Engage your lower abdominals and bring your centre of mass lower. Keep your shoulders relaxed with shoulder blades set back and down. Keep your neck and head relaxed, stationary and in a neutral position. Keep your movements slow, controlled and purposeful. Pass your paddle under the hull of the kayak and then back again. To make this more challenging, 
Try have a race with a friend or count how many cycles you can complete within one minute.